والولع الروسي بكل ما هو مصري على مر العصور. Мусторонного сотрудничества в разных сферах культуры и искусства. Дорогие гости, отмечая наш с вами гуманитарный год, следует вспомнить огромный фонд российского творчества, которое вдохновляло многих творческих людей Египта на протяжении долгих поколений. Следует также помнить интерес и увлечение россиян ко всему, что относится к Египту на протяжении многих поколений. Ladies and gentlemen, the Ministry of Culture, in collaboration with the Ministry, uh, with the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Egypt, as well as the corresponding bodies in Russia, has has joined, has has held, is holding this this festival with all art troops uh, with all uh, to which all the uh, art artistic representatives of both countries would be taking part yes yes the only recently a film for uh, short uh, films and features has been held and uh, seminars have been held on the impact of both literatures of both countries on the other's literature. В которых принимают активное участие все министерства, ведомства и, и структурные подразделения Министерства культуры. Эти мероприятия будут проводиться в течение целого года, и они завершатся в мае 2022 года в Москве. Have, who have contributed to the holding of this festival and let culture and arts be the emblem under which we, uh, we, uh, we should gather together and best of luck to everyone. Thank you very much to Her Excellency, the Minister of Culture, uh, the, the Minister of Culture of Egypt. Now. The floor is being given to Her Excellency uh, uh, Lady uh, Gailova, the, uh, the Deputy uh, Minister of Culture of the Russian Federation. Now the floor is hers. <coughs> поприветствовать всех на, на мероприятии официального открытия перекрестного года гуманитарного сотрудничества между Россией и Египтом. Dear friends, good, uh, good evening to you all. As a representative of the, the government of the Russian Federation, let me extend the, uh, the, the, the heartfelt gratitude and uh, greetings of the Russian government to you all, to everyone attending. As, a, as I have, as Her Excellency, the Minister of Culture of Egypt, uh, Dr. Dias Abdel Daim, has already said that in, in year 2018, the two presidents of both countries, President Abdel Fattah of Egypt and Vladimir Putin, has, uh, they, they in 2018, uh, decided to, to designate year 2021 as a year of cultural exchange between the two countries. <coughs> 
проектов, которые мы воплотим в культуре, в образовании, в науке, в спорте, в молодежной политике, в туризме и, конечно же, в литературе. As for Russia, this decision for designating this designation for this year is so has been so significant because it it's an epitome of uh, epitome of how close relations and cooperation have always been between the two countries in all areas such as education sports uh, education sports uh, and all other areas of cooperation и он позволит нам выстроить горизонтальные связи между нашими учреждениями, между нашими регионами и между нашим бизнесом. I'm fully convinced that this this year will uh, is to open up new uh, horizons of cooperation between the two countries. подготовили большой план самых разнообразных мероприятий, и мы абсолютно уверены, что он никого не оставит равнодушным. The, the ministries of the two countries, ministries of culture, uh, the two countries, ministries of culture have been working hard to prepare and arrange for this uh, beautiful gathering tonight. минут на этой замечательной исторической сцене состоится концерт прославленного коллектива, хореографического ансамбля танца «Березка». From a very spectacular show to be put up tonight by one of the uh, by one of Russia's uh, very uh, uh, troop of ballet troop. Well, this art troop, uh, you are going, your excellencies are going to watch now, is not just uh, the troop of art in Russia, but it represents uh, it's an epitome of art and culture in Russia as well. Ladies and gentlemen, you are going to watch uh, Russian art, and I'm sure they are going to perceive for yourselves the uh, 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 the soul of Russian art. <coughs> I do hope that you, are you will be enjoying this show. This is a spectacular show, and you emerge with a very good impression of uh, Russia's art. Thank you. Thank you to Her Excellency, uh, to, thank you to Her Excellency Yolga Erilova, the Deputy Minister of Culture. Now the floor is uh, the floor is to uh, His Excellency, His Excellency Ambassador Mahmoud Talat, the Deputy Foreign Minister uh, of Foreign Affairs of Egypt, representing uh, Egypt's Minister, Top Diplomat, Minister of Foreign Relations. It it gives me. It gives me great pleasure tonight to read to read out the speech, the address, the address, the address, uh, the address of uh, His Excellency Mr. Samah Shukri, Ambassador Samah Shukri, the Minister of Culture, Dr. Inas Yerilova, Mr. Yerilova, uh, Dr. Inas Abdeddaim, the Minister of Culture. Mr. Burgi Bursinko, the ambassador of Russia to Egypt, ladies and gentlemen attending. First of all, let me greet. Let me greet. Uh, uh, let, uh, let me first of all uh, greet all guests of Egypt. On top of them being the deputy minister of culture of Russia and the organizing committee of this uh, art gathering. Let me also let me also welcome uh, a galaxy of artists who uh, whom we have uh, we have had the honor of having tonight. This gathering, ladies and gentlemen, is a milestone of uh, Egyptian-Russian relations. The two countries have always have always held such gatherings uh, in uh, as a. Uh, in a sign of uh, uh, growing ties between the two countries and all and time tested uh, relations between the two 
хочу приветствовать дорогих гостей Египта, заместителя министра культуры Российской Федерации, членов Российской делегации, членов Организационного комитета по подготовке и проведению прекрестного года гуманитарного сотрудничества между Россией и Египтом 2021-2022 год. Также хочу поприветствовать приглашенных почетных гостей, высокопоставленных лиц, творческих людей и литераторов, которые пришли сегодня на торжественную церемонию открытия гуманитарного года, и тем самым они оказали нам большую честь. Без всякого сомнения, прекрестный год гуманитарного сотрудничества является знаковым событием и светлым моментом в истории российско-египетских отношений и воспринимается как добавление к полному списку уникальных событий, связывающих оба дружеских Государства и подтверждает глубину и прочность отношений двух стран. Uh, today, today's gathering, tonight's festival, gala festival, signals how old relations have always been between the two countries. This gathering and this year. The two, the two presidents of both countries uh, agreed in 2018 to designate this year as the year of cultural exchange between them. The designation of this year as such has since ushered in, has ushered in more events which all denote how relations between the two countries have been, have been uh, uh, massively growing. Ties, bilateral ties, bilateral ties between the two countries have positively been growing in recent years, particularly with the ushering in of a partnership agreement being uh, put into effect in, in recent months. The two countries have recently seen uh, eye to eye with each other as uh, to a broad spectrum of issues. We, as such, uh, uh, with relations uh, having reached such a great point at an apex, we are, uh, we are looking forward to uh, the resumption of flights between, between Russia and Egypt. Все это найдет свое отражение не только в тесных политических отношениях, но и будет касаться культурных, экономических и общественных сфер. With the, with, the, with the two political leaderships of both countries uh, with, uh, uh, giving, an instruction, giving an instruction to the, um, to the government of both countries to work to push forward towards the designation of this year, the two countries' concerned bodies have been making arrangements for uh, uh, holding this, arrange, uh, this festival and making the climate more conducive to uh, uh, further fostering of relations between the two countries to, towards, towards opening up a constructive dialogue between the two countries. The two sides have been making persistent, persisting efforts uh, 
towards the declaration, uh, towards launching uh, the joint declaration uh, at the beginning of this year. Для проведения прекрестного года гуманитарного сотрудничества между Россией и Египтом начались активные контакты между компетентными органами в Москве и Каире для того, чтобы мероприятия, которые планируется провести в рамках этого года, завершились достойно и на том же уровне, на котором находится и цивилизованное наследие двух стран. Мы прекрасно понимаем важность культурного компонента в обогащении взаимного диалога и в создании благоприятного климата для достижения нового подъема в отношениях двух стран. Мы также убеждены, что этот культурный компонент играет важную роль в построении мостов общения и укреплении основ постоянного и конструктивного диалога на политическом и народном уровнях. России и Египтом были приложены большие усилия для достижения декларации о намерениях проведения гуманитарного года между Россией и Египтом, подписание которой состоялось 17 мая 2021 года. Это было фактическим стартом данному событию. This signing of this joint declaration has, cul has culminated a sincere and staunch efforts made since 2018 on both sides, with all concerned bodies in both countries contributing to these efforts. Actually, these efforts ref reflect the importance attached by both countries to this huge and massive cultural heritage of both countries. The forthcoming, the forthcoming, the forthcoming period would be witnessing would be witnessing sports uh, cultural exchange as well as launching a translation, the translation of uh, a great number of books between the two countries, as well as further cooperation in plastic arts uh, culture, as well as protecting cultural heritage of both countries as well as in the areas of bibliography, books and museums. There will be efforts in the forthcoming period to get each, each country more knowledgeable of the culture, of the culture, uh, uh, the broad spectrum of culture in, of the other country. And we do hope, with the situation as such, we do hope uh, to, uh, that uh, ties would be f further developed between both of them. В этой работе приняли активное участие многочисленные министерства, ведомства и организации как с российской, так и с египетской стороны. Каждая сторона продемонстрировала свое видение и вид участия в мероприятиях, которые будут проведены в рамках столь важного события. Это отражает полное понимание этими органами важности обмена культурным наследием двух из древнейших в мире цивилизаций. Среди достигнутых результатов следует особо подчеркнуть разработку масштабной культурной программы, в которую входят обмен студентами, совместные спортивные мероприятия, активизация переводческой деятельности, обмен визитами выдающихся деятелей науки, обмен делегациями в сфере музыкального искусства, театрального искусства, изобразительных искусств, сохранение и реставрации древностей, библиотечного дела и музейного сотрудничества. Все названные сферы призваны сблизить оба дружеских народа и позволить близко познакомиться с двумя цивилизациями, российской и египетской. Это также внесет существенный вклад в обмен опытами и максимальное увлечение пользы от взаимодействия в научной, литературной и спортивной сферах. Ladies and gentlemen, finally, as my address comes to a close, I'd like to pay tribute to pay tribute to, to everyone who has contributed to the gathering, to the arrangement and holding of this uh, art festival. Particularly against, particularly as uh, as uh, against the background of the spread of COVID-19 pandemic. Finally, let me welcome once more 
our uh, Russian friends to the second country of Egypt, wishing them all the best of luck. Ведомствами Хочу вам сказать добро пожаловать на вашу вторую родину. Желаю всем больших и постоянных успехов. Спасибо за внимание. Thank you to His Excellency Ambassador Mahmoud Talad, Assistant Foreign Minister of Egypt for Cultural Ties. Now, now, now His Excellency uh, now Ambassador Yorgi Borisinka, uh, Ambassador of the Russian Federation, will be having the floor now. Today we are about to give the go-ahead signal to, the, uh, to this festival which marks the beginning of a year of cultural exchange between the two countries. This event of uh, this year being designated as a year of cultural exchange between the two countries would be lasting for a longer time. This event, this gathering we are attending tonight, tonight should have been should have been held earlier. But had it not been for the uh, COVID-19 pandemic, it has been delayed until now. However, however, despite international restrictions, our uh, uh, humanitarian ties between the two countries have been growing massively. Last year, Cairo, Cairo witnessed Cairo witnessed the the you unveiled under unveiled the two statues of a famous Russian ballerina as well as uh, the Russian uh, cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin. Russians and Egyptians feel that they ha the, uh, do uh, uh, harbor good ties, do have good sentiments for each other. In Russia, Russia people still remember, still cherish how strong and how very good ties were during the era of late Egyptian President Gamal Abdel Nasser. In well, during the, the era of the 1960s, uh, Egypt uh, uh, witnessed the creation of more than 60 industrial facilities with the Russian assistance, with the Russian assistance. Russia has also helped Egypt create the National Circus, a national art troupe, as well as training personnel, as well as granting Egypt military uh, and economic assistance. Well, with this gathering, Egypt, Egyptian Russian cooperation is at the threshold of a new era of uh, flourishing cooperation. 
with President, uh, with the Excellency President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi being credited with having pushed relations to such a new height. President, His Excellency President Abdel Fattah al-Sisi has always been keenly interested in fostering ties between himself and uh, His Excellency President, uh, President uh, Putin. There has been an, there ha, well, uh, and uh, there has been an important, and uh, with uh, on March the 10th, a new partnership agreement, uh, cooperation, economic cooperation agreement partnership agreement has come into effect since March the 10th and on the international arena the two countries Egypt and Russia have been genuinely cooperating at all international forums vis -a -vis and vis-a-vis -vis a broad spectrum a broad spectrum on on a broad spectrum of international issues the two countries have either produced identical views or almost shared the same views. And let me give you an example. Rus atom of Russia of the uh, uh, nuclear of the nuclear of the nu of nuclear uh, energy is uh, is assisting Egypt nowadays with the creation of uh, of Egypt's first nuclear power plant at the Daba on the northern coast. I'd like also to pay tribute and praise uh, uh, Egyptians' uh, uh, growing passion for learning the Russian language. There have been, there have been more than 1,600 Egyptian people who, who have uh, been learning Russia either in Cairo and, and at Russian language centers in, in Cairo and Alexandria. And by, do, by doing so, they seem to show uh, the Russian brothers and sisters very good uh, fraternal and uh, uh, amicable, uh, relay, uh, amicable feelings. And this is going to open up new vistas of cooperation between uh, countries uh, and give uh, Egyptians unrestricted access, access to know better uh, uh, Russia's culture. And with this event, uh, uh, this event is uh, only a step on the road towards fostered relations between the two countries. The, with uh, the expansion of ties in all areas of education, sports and so on, it has been reciprocal between the two countries. Egyptians have been more than ever interested in Russia's culture and the same applies to Russians. Russians have also shown the same interest. So Russia, Russia is expecting all Egyptians' art troops who are going to present the art, Egyptian art in Russia. I'm fully confident that this year of human cooperation will help uh, each of the two countries' people to uh, have a look at the uh, other countries' cultural heritage, and this is going to and this is bound to further push forward cooperation between the two countries. Thank you very much. Thank you very much to His Excellency uh, President Ambassador Yorgi Brizyanka, the Ambassador of the Russian Federation to Cairo. Dear audience, 
creativeness in Russia and Egypt have been, have been multiple. And this year being designated as the year of cultural exchange between, exchange between Egypt and Russia will, will help show the, uh, the diction of uh, uh, creativity. Briosky, Briosky, dancing troupe of Russia is going to lay the first uh, lay uh, the founding stone uh, of further cooperation. Let's enjoy together uh, the, uh, uh, the, the dancing of the troupe at, at this happy evening. Прекрасный год гуманитарного сотрудничества между двумя нашими сторонами демонстрирует творческую и культурную динамику в каждом обществе и проявляет многие аспекты общественного сознания. И сегодня государственный академический, академический хореографический ансамбль «Березка» имени Надежды Надежденной при управлении делами президента Российской Федерации делает первый шаг на долгом пути гуманитарного года между Москвой и Каиром. А теперь нас ждет одно из потрясающе интересных выступлений этого замечательного ансамбля. Желаем вам приятного просмотра. Всего вам доброго.
Все пути на холма горы замела, завеяла, Пусть метелица нагрянет, будет снежно на полях. Здесь небес хороших много, нам не быть в холостяках. Зимушка холодная, двинская, падает снежиночки друг друга. Снежно на полях, здесь небес.